to get OpenTX uh, flashed onto the board of the radio you need to add a USB programmer either by hard soldering it onto the main board or you can buy a smarty parts board that just slots in and sits on the right contacts um, that smarty parts board was used to be an extra fifty dollars uh, but you can get them for about uh, get basic versions for about twenty two dollars Australia now so that's a cheaper alternative now if you're not confident enough to or, or you don't want to buy the smarty parts board or you don't want to have to solder on the USB programmer uh, you can get a Turnigy 9XR or 9XR Pro which already has the uh, USB programmer installed and already has OpenTX or a version of OpenTX installed on the radio so that's a good alternative the problem is this radio doesn't come with a module you have to pay extra for a module um, and well, this is a, a good uh, module to have because it, take, it makes use of the internal uh, antenna in this radio and the problem is you can't buy that in Australia you have to buy that from uh, places like Banggood or on eBay uh, I'll put a link in the description for that anyway uh, I can put the 9X module in here I can put the FR Sky module in here and this will also operate all the same receivers that the 9X when I'm using that module another problem with this radio it's a great radio it's got voice and uh, vibration feedback but it's very poor ergonomically it feels like you're handling a brick it's big and chunky sharp edges um, and it's unfortunate if they had have stuck with the form factor of the 9X uh, but the functionality of the 9XR Pro would have been fantastic of course if you've got the money you need to get a uh, Tyrannus that's about $300 worth of the, whereas the others will add up to about 100 or so $120 this is about $300 Australian but um, it's just a fantastic radio absolutely love it uh, it has a, a FR Sky module built in but it also has a slot for another module so you can put a second FR Sky module in and double up the number of channels to 32 or you can put different modules in as well awesome radio if you can afford it now why do I have all these different radios well this one uh, was my first programmable radio uh, and I'm passing that on to a friend so that's moving on my 9XR Pro I use for uh, slope sawers or uh, park flyers where I'm not I don't want extreme range or telemetry um, some of the slope soaring sites are uh, coastal dunes so there are a lot of salt spray and you can see the old 9x is rusting about out a bit on the switches so this is for close in flying slope sawers rugged sites and I use the Tyrannus for uh, planes where I want good range and telemetry feedback as well but yeah, I'd rather not take this one down the coastal dunes so all of these radios are running op different versions of OpenTX um, so the programming, programming sort of ideas are all the same uh, and I can probably swap models from uh, radio to radio but I love OpenTX and I can't use anything else now anything else feels too restricted